In this problem we're told that the historic mean yield of corn in Canada is 130 bushels per acre. In order to test if there's been any change, a sample of 49 farmers was selected and the farmers reported a sample average yield of 132.4 bushels per acre. The question is, is there evidence to conclude at a 5% level of significance that the current yield has changed from historic averages? So first of all, our null hypothesis, H0, is that there is no change. It's still 130 bushels per acre. The alternative is actually two-sided in this case, because we just want to know is there a change. It doesn't say one way or the other. Our significance level alpha is 0.05. So this is what we'll compare the p-value to to make a decision about uh, whether or not to reject the null hypothesis. All right, well, our test statistic just looks like where it's x bar minus mu divided by sigma over the square root of n. So in this case, we've got 132.4 minus 130 divided by sigma. It's 10 bushels per acre over the square root of 49. And after calculating, we find that that's equal to 1.68. So now if we draw a picture of our standard normal distribution, so this is z, it's centered at 0. Let's see, 1.68 is, I don't know, around there somewhere. Now the p-value is equal to the area in this tail here plus the area in the corresponding tail at the lower end, minus 1.68, this part right here. The two tails have the same area, so either one of them will do, and then you can just double it. Uh, it turns out it's probably easier to plug actually minus 1.68 into Excel because norms dist will give exactly this area. Anyway, if you do that, what happens is it turns out we get p is twice uh, about 0.0465, and that is equal to 0 0.093. Okay, so there's the p value. Uh, here is the significance level, and notice the p value is bigger than alpha in this case. So because of that, we conclude that there's not enough evidence to reject the null hypothesis, so not enough evidence to conclude that there's been a change from historic averages. Okay, so we do not reject H0.